Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about one of the most intriguing upcoming fighter jets on the global stage, the Suhoi Su-75 Checkmate. This aircraft has captured attention since its reveal, not just for its bold name, but for what it promises in terms of capability, price, and next-gen performance. Let's break down what we know so far. The Su-75 Checkmate is a fifth-generation single-engine stealth fighter currently in development by Russia's United Aircraft Corporation under the Suhoi brand. It was officially unveiled at the MOX 2021 air show, and right away it made headlines for being Russia's attempt to offer a more affordable alternative to the F-35 for export markets. But beyond the hype, there are some genuinely interesting aspects of this aircraft. Design-wise, the Checkmate is built with stealth in mind. It features a sleek, angular fuselage, an internal weapons bay, and AV tail configuration similar to what we've seen on other stealth fighters. The engine is mounted in a way that reduces the aircraft's radar signature, and overall, the shape is clearly focused on minimizing detectability while maximizing aerodynamic performance. One of the key selling points of the Su-75 is its cost efficiency. It's being positioned as a low-cost, high-capability fighter aimed at countries that want fifth-generation performance without the hefty price tag of Western alternatives. Suhoi has stated that the Checkmate will be significantly cheaper than the F-35, both in terms of purchase and operating costs, which could make it very appealing for nations with smaller defense budgets. Performance-wise, the Su-75 is expected to be fast and agile. Suhoi claims it will reach speeds up to Mach 1.8 and have a combat radius of around 1,500 km. It will be powered by the latest generation of Russian jet engines, possibly a variant of the Izdeli A-30, which is being developed for the Su-57. That would mean high thrust-to-weight ratio and supercruise capabilities, flying at supersonic speeds without using afterburners. In terms of armament, the Checkmate is designed to carry a wide range of weapons, including air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles, all housed internally to preserve stealth. It will likely support the latest Russian missile technology, such as the R-77 for aerial combat and precision-guided bombs for strike missions. An unmanned version is also being discussed for future development, which would add another layer of versatility. The cockpit is designed to be fully digital, with a modern glass interface and a wide panoramic display. Suhoi has emphasized ease of use and advanced pilot assistance systems, which would reduce workload and improve situational awareness. It's also expected to feature a robust sensor suite, including an advanced radar system and electronic warfare capabilities to match or exceed current generation fighters. As of now, the Su-75 is still in its prototype phase. A flying demonstrator was expected by 2024, with serial production possibly starting later in the decade, depending on funding and demand. Russia is targeting international buyers, especially in the Middle East, Asia, and Africa, regions where Western jets may be politically or financially out of reach. The big question is whether the Su-75 will deliver on all of its promises. Russia has a strong legacy of building capable fighters, but developing and producing a fifth-generation jet that's competitive on the global market is a massive challenge. We've seen delays in cost overruns on projects like the Su-57, so it remains to be seen if the Checkmate can avoid similar issues. Still, if successful, the Su-75 Checkmate could be a game-changer. It would give many countries access to stealth and fifth-gen performance at a much lower price point. It also reflects a growing shift in the fighter jet market, where affordability, multi-role capability, and advanced sensors are becoming just as important as raw speed or firepower. That's our look at the Suhoi Su-75 Checkmate. If you enjoyed this breakdown, make sure to like and subscribe for more coverage of military aviation and future tech. Let me know in the comments. Do you think the Checkmate will be a serious rival to the F-35? Or will it remain more of a prototype concept? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.